The Saskatchewan government is opening up the retail market for cannabis stores. Now, it previously held a lottery which was criticized by prospective owners and the opposition. Back in 2018, it received 1,500 applications for 51 pot shop permits in 32 communities and First Nations around the province. Now, starting in April, applications will be allowed for communities of fewer than 2,500 people. Then in September, they'll open up the process province-wide, allowing prospective pot shop owners to apply for their store in their community of choice. The minister responsible says it's an attempt to knock out the black market and help consumers. There's obviously a, uh, a minimum price where it makes sense to do business, but of course uh, competition leads to uh, more choice and, and more convenience and, uh, and, and normally better pricing. So we'll, we'll, uh, we'll see that and uh, I think we'll monitor that of course. The NDP says it's in favour of opening up the market for more stores to open. We've heard a lot of concerns about the uh, lottery system and we raised a lot of concerns about it. We uh, all were also worried that there weren't going to be enough permits uh, that were issued about a year ago. That's the case. Uh, so we're happy to see that uh, there is going to be more opportunity in this market for Saskatchewan. The government says it will be up to municipalities to decide how many pot shops they want in the community or they can opt out altogether. There will be no limits on how many permits the governments will hand out and there'll be no conditions on concentration of ownership in communities of more than 2,500 people. And applicants will still have to pass the background and security checks required by the government. Adam Hunter, CBC News, Regina.